Sometimes I get a good feeling, yeah. JP on the board. We got the fridge with the water filter and the ice maker because this is a necessity, okay? I don't know who ever told you that this wasn't a necessity, but it is. Everybody needs one of these. This is very convenient. You get a bottle of water bottles. Fill it up. You just fill up your right here. Yeah. And then we got all this cabinet space to put all the stuff in, which is nice. We got the trash. Now what the hell am I supposed to do with these little things? Why would they give us the little, you're gonna have to take the trash out every day. That's ridiculous. Okay. But yeah. And we got all this storage in the island. You see? All these drawers there. Um, oh, that's your shoes. <laughs> <laughs> shelves right here. That other shelf I got, I don't think it's gonna fit anywhere in here. So I think I might put all of the like wine and like, make this like a bar area for now or just like bar slash like decor space area and put stuff right here. If they didn't have this little thing right here, you could really make this like a built-in desk. Well, actually it's not even enough for this, but I don't know, we'll figure it out. This is, this is the master bedroom. Um, also, not very big. Um, our bed, of course, will fit in here and I stand, but it's not as big as our bedroom now. Um, I don't think any like, extra bed will fit in here. I feel like the bed will come out as well to where you can still put like the dresser in here too, and it'll be all right, but it's really not that big. But. We'll make it work. We got all this storage in here. All of this nice to put like all the towels or like linen and stuff here. So that's cool. I got a stand up shower and it has a little niche like cut out in it to put my product in. I want to be real fancy, you know, and get like the, um, what you call it, like the bottles that you can put like the shampoo, conditioner, like on your soap and all that stuff in there. I just feel like, I'll be switching on my products too much to where it's not gonna be the same. I can see if I do the same stuff all the time, it'll be all right. But because I switch up, I don't know. We'll see if I do that, because I want it to look nice. But like this, every, the whole place is like very warm toned, and you know I'm usually a black and white girl. 
okay my black and white aesthetic is don't really fit in this space so i think i might have to switch up some things and alter to more of a neutral aesthetic instead of a stark black and white so we'll see but yeah now this part All of my, okay. Look at all this space. Look at all this, all this storage. Okay, I can hang all my stuff up. I can put some of the stuff out of my dresser in these drawers. Also, small clothes. We love the built-in closet. Okay, this is the main reason we got this apartment. Okay, it did. I told you the granite countertops almost had me being a hell no. But then I saw the closet and I was like, yeah, built <laughs> countertops. Okay, countertops. You moving in, all right? So, yeah, this closet is huge, you use shape. And like I said again, it's all mine. So all my stuff that fit in here perfectly have so much store. I love that they have the, like I said, the drawers in here. I can stack up and put my shoes on here. I can hang my clothes. I can have like a separate section for like fall, like in winter stuff and like summer and spring, you know, on the other side or However, I want to do it. I, I have this place to separate it out. Oh, awesome. I'm glad that I can. Whoever sleep, who, talking to you, whoever sleeps without a fan on, you're a psycho. Who sleeps without, is, is it you? It's you me. sleep without a fan? Okay, you have sinus issues. I, I yeah. understand that. Okay, if you have sinus issues, I forgive you for not sleeping with a fan on. But if you don't and you like to be hot sleeping, you're a psychopath because be <laughs> Also forgot to mention is the living room slash kitchen, which I don't know why they thought this area was a good space to put this stuff. But this is the coat closet. Um, I'm gonna put all my cleaning supplies and stuff in here. And this is the pantry, which I guess is technically still a part of the kitchen, but it's like, why? I don't know. I just feel like they didn't, they didn't think about it when they built this. The main thing. This mud look great, beautiful mud look, right? Why is dust off in the corner? The mud look is supposed to be right in the entryway. <laughs> so this is the mud look area. I don't know why the f they put it, um, it over here in the corner. It really doesn't make any sense. It needs to be next to the door so that you can put stuff you know, where you enter and exit, that's the purpose of the look in my opinion. But I think we might just make this like Theo space, put all of his like baskets with his toys and all of his like room and stuff here. Um, but honestly, I don't really know. I'll, we'll figure out how to make this something. But yeah, it's dumb as hell they put that shit right there. I don't know. I feel like, again, just not thinking. But, and then this too, like, I feel like this face, like, imagine if you got, like, parcels that stick out. You have to shimmy through this. Like, because look at the logic. Anyway, so, yeah, so. They also have this little eco video, like the nest. I've never used this one. I only use the nest. I'm assuming you could set it up. Girl, why is Damn, it is a little warm in here. Let me turn it down. I'm gonna put on a nice day meat too. Um, yeah, I'm sure you connect, can connect it to your phone. So, that'd be nice. Basically the same. Got the same uh, little linen space, storage, same amount of drawers. So he's not missing out on those spaces. His bathroom is actually bigger than mine. Not think about it, but he has this space next to the toilet, like he could put his like dirty clothes camper and stuff in, or whatever else he wants to put in there. And he has a stand up shower, too. So, you know, pretty good for him. Um, this is like our way to his closet that he no longer has to share with me, taking up all the space. Um, he has built in in here as well, it's not as big. So he, he does lose out on a little bit of space in the closet, but it's enough space for his shoes, which is all that really matters to him. Um, so he has this whole side of built-ins and he also has um, 
all of this storage on this side right here. So I'm sure he'll be grateful for that. Um, and then we'll end off in the spare bedroom. Now, what we're gonna do with this bedroom, don't know. Um, I'm probably gonna put my desk slash vanity in here to start, but once I get my new couch, I'm gonna put the current couch in here. It's just gonna be like a little lounge space. Like, you know how, like, you go to, like, old black people house and they got a living room in the den, and you go to, like, if that's how it's gonna be. You can still sit on my living room furniture, though. It ain't gonna have no plastic on it. This time. <laughs> it ain't gonna have no plastic on it. You can still sit in the living room. But this is probably gonna be like the den area. And then you probably put like his TV and his TV stand and his games. And he might get a little gaming chair. He can sit in here and like play his games and stuff. And then my desk will probably still be here. So we are sharing this room. So it's gonna be another. It'll be a flex space to be wherever we want it to be. So, yeah. This is the apartment. I will see how I love it. We're not the person else to live here, which is kind of bad. But I think we're on like the second one, so it's still pretty new-ish. It's still got somebody else's little bump on it and little scratches and shit on the floor that I will report because I'm not paying for the shit that I leave. But overall, I think I'm gonna like it. And if I don't, <laughs> I'm not. See y'all in the next one. Be sure to subscribe to see all of my moving vlogs. You see me?